Hello, babe. It's so good to see you. When I looked at the schedule today and I saw that you were coming in for brows, I was so excited. I was like, yay, my favorite person. So tell me, what are we thinking of doing today for your brows? Okay, so just a wax, like just a little bit of a shape up. What are you thinking of the length? Do you like how it is or do you want me to trim it a little bit? You like the length? Okay, you want it to grow out a little bit so you can laminate? Perfectly understandable. We'll take a seat, my love. Let me go ahead. I already did have some wax here prepared because I figured we would need that. For some reason, there's eyeliner stuck on my nail. Okay, anyway, I'm just going to use a little wipe on your face and that way we get off any oil. You're not wearing any product, right, on your brows? Wow, well, they've come really a long way. Because remember... You used to always have to wear some type of brow wax or something similar because your brows were not that full. I'm so excited for you. I'm so glad that they're finally coming in the way you want. So I'm just gonna, oops. <laughs> I'm just going to wipe your brows and just very gently back and forth. You know the procedure. And then when we're done, was it the last time that you were here was when we did the baby powder on your skin after? Yeah, okay. Ooh, so what we're gonna do, did you like it? You did? Okay, we'll do that again. So what I'm gonna do is take these tweezers, I'm not gonna pluck anything right now, but I'm just gonna kind of measure up from the end of your nose to the tail of your brow and see about how symmetrical we are because I'm going to make sure that we get you relatively mm, let me see before I say anything because I remember your one side was a little bit more difficult to get to match actually it's looking very good the only thing is your tail comes in which what I'm about to say is very normal. I have the same thing. Your tail comes in a little bit more on the inner edge here, whereas this one's slightly more out. So that's what's giving it an appearance that's looking just a little uneven. I know you have some concerns about that, but it's actually a pretty easy fix. You hear my squeaky shoe? What I'm going to do is just go ahead and um, remove that tiny, tiny bit of hair that's growing right here on the inner, or I mean the upper eyelid right there, right where it starts to curve around, because if we remove even just five, six hairs, you'd be surprised at the immense difference in shape that you'll see visually. So let's go ahead and do that. I have some really pretty and cute pink soft wax. Look. Look how cute. And I have this little stick. Just giving it a good mix. A very good mix. I'm going to go ahead and do the underneath of this one first since it doesn't need as much sculpting and then we will stick on our little fabric sheet here. Ready? Yeah, okay. So I'm just going to place this right here under your brow. Get a little bit up there more. Perfect. And smooth 
smooth it out. And I'm going to set this. We're going to get a little bit of a larger fabric, I guess. We'll do this larger strip since that's kind of a big spot. I'm going to put this here. Sorry, I didn't mean to hit you in the cheek. Alright. And we'll just leave it for a couple seconds and then we'll rip it off. Okay, let me just feel and see if it's ready. Oh yeah, that feels good. I'm just gonna peel up the inner corner here, or sorry, the tail end. And one, two, three. Perfect. So sticky. Okay. And let's scope the top part of that brow now. That came out beautiful on the bottom. Okay, the same thing. I'm gonna go across the top and down. Right across. Just adding a little bit more of a thicker layer so that it gets everything. Okay. And we're going to put our little sheet. And just give it a second so it can set. Gonna go ahead and peel up the end. And one, two, three. Perfect. How'd that feel? Hurt a little bit. Sometimes they do hurt worse than other times. Okay, let me see. That looks good. I am gonna do. I'm not gonna do the middle until after we do this one, but I'm gonna do a little tiny bit more on this upper inner edge. Ever so slightly right here. Just a minuscule amount. Okay. And let's get the fabric. Okay. And now we wait just a couple seconds. You know the drill. Now this one shouldn't hurt at all because it's just a very small little section. I'm gonna rip it this way. Let me see. Actually, no, I'm not. There you go. You okay? Not so bad. Yeah, I told you it was a small piece right there. Alright, let me just rub to see how that looks. Looks. What I say like that, it looks. Okay. That's good. Let's work on your other side because this one needs just a bit more sculpting under there. Oh no, got some wax on me, hold on. Can't have that. Okay. Okay, let's do underneath. And we're gonna take just a little tip of this tail end off that's growing underneath. Okay. That looks perfect. Now we stick on our little sheet. This is plenty long enough. I don't even need the super long one. I'm going to put it right here underneath. Okay, now we just wait a minute and rip it off. Okay, let's go ahead and feel. Yeah, that's ready. I'm just going to pick, 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 pick. You okay? <laughs> okay. Put this one down. 
and let me see how that looks in relation to the other one. Oh yeah, they're very symmetrical now in that problem area, so not to worry. Send the re best regards to the chef, me. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and do the top, and then we'll do the middle between your brows. shoes keep, keep squeaking on this floor. That is a super smooth um, application right there. So let's put this on and just give it a couple moments and we'll rip it off. I'm just getting a little hot in here. Okay, come on. Perfect. You okay? <laughs> All right. Well, last but not least, we just have to do this one spot right here in between your brows, and then once that's done, you'll be done, and we'll be able to put the powder on, and you can go about your way with your new amazing brows. So, can you tolerate one more little swipe right here? I know you can. I'm just being funny. All right, let's put it on. Okay, I'm just going to do this in an upwards pattern, so we're going to go up. Make these very even. Okay, okay let's put this on. And just give it a couple moments. That one dries pretty quick. I didn't have to put too much. They look really cute. Yeah, they look really good. Ready? All right. One, two, three. Okay. Good. Now what we're going to do is go ahead and wipe you off with the powder. Let me move the not wipe you off. You don't have to be wiped off. I mean, I'm just going to put the powder on you. <laughs> wipe you off with the powder. Yeah, great. It sounds so relaxing. Okay. I'm just going to... Feels cooling, soothing, perfect. Oops, sorry. Okay, and a little bit right there. Lovely. Check them out, let me know what you think. You love them? Yay. Let me just double check, let's see. I'm going to use the stick for reference. Let me just check where your end of your tail is versus your nose now. Oh, perfect. Let me see this side. Amazing. The symmetry is like, couldn't be better. We got that perfectly. So if you want to come back in maybe like two weeks or so, I think by that time you'll have enough to laminate them if you want. Yeah? Perfect. Well, I will see you in about three weeks or so, and we'll get you even another brow transformation, okay, babe? Alright, thanks for coming to see me. Bye-bye.